what's going on it's been a while I know I haven't done a vlog in a while a lot of the crazy stuff's been going on in my life so even my podcasts are gonna slow down for a little bit because I have to have a little bit of surgery going on so I'm okay don't worry uh, I just have to have some stuff done with my mouth so not fun but anyway we are back at fight life you know I love it here we're back at the brewery so we're gonna get some drinks we're gonna see some really good wrestling stack card make sure you watch it on fight TV so a lot of good stuff coming up like that. Hello. Oh shit. How are you? No ready. What, what's this for? The pod. The, oh. Okay, so question. What's up? This is a good question. Okay. All right, so we're at the brewery, right? If you had a beer named after you. Mm -hmm. What would it be called, and what kind of beer would it be? Mm. <laughs> It'd be a nice stout beer, I'll tell you that. Because okay. I'm, I'm a dark beer kind of guy. I like me a dark beer. A stout. 10% alcohol, so it's real strong. Mm -hmm. uh, 10% and uh, it would be called the six pack attack. Oh, I like that. And sell them in six packs. Ooh. <laughs> I like Only that. Only six packs. <laughs> Coming to the brewery I'm a, near I'm you. A big, I'm a beer man. I kind of like, like that. I like classy craft stuff. Right, right. It's just perfect in wrestling. A nice you know? Russian Imperial Stout or a Milk Stout. One of those things. Ooh, I like that. I like 10%. Yeah, real, real strong. Deal, yeah. So you got to drink it in a little tiny little glass. It's so strong you gotta that nurse it makes it. the abs for exactly. you. Exactly. See? You just nurse it and you'll have abs in no time. I love it. You want me to do it? Okay, so we're going to ask you a question. Sure, ask me some questions. Alright, so the question of the day is... Okay. If there was a beer named after you, what kind would it be and what would it be called? Uh, I mean, honestly, it would be a, a good old American lager. It would be a Chudweiser, baby. Get yourself a Chudweiser, get yourself a Chud Light. Hey, if you're looking, you can get a Chud Ice, too, baby. Mm -hmm. So what would yours be called? A Chudweiser. Chudweiser? Your well, name? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I feel like it should be like, like, like a Chudweiser or something like that. It's a Chudweiser. Get a Chud Mike. You're looking to say some Get a Chud Mike. I like Chud that. Mike, you get yeah. a Chud Mike. You come out after your match. You go to the bar. You, you smash on the street. That's it. I <laughs> smash one over my head too. <laughs> Can't come to a brewery and not have any beer. Just saying. Found Sammy. What's up? What's up, baby? I told you I'm a walking store. We're I here. know. We look at that. I got the got table. The pop. We got a pop up we shop got my right now. Stuff over here too. <laughs> Top five merch. We got. We got number one number merch. One. Over here. And we I like got, these I'm little getting, folks. I'm I'm this guy. Ready. Big match. Dusty. Big match. Dusty. Dusty. We got the hats, got the hats. Okay. going on. All right, we got for Sammy. Ready? Ready for this question? All right. So, if. If you were to name a beer, what would it be called, and what type of beer would it be? Ooh, it would be a, a lager. Ooh. Um, it'll be top five aces. Okay, I like that. Only top five aces to <laughs> drink this shit, bro. That's it. Huh? We can't ask Dusty. He's not 21. Yeah. Well, he is 21 now. I don't know, so I know nothing about it. I don't yeah, who can't ask him? We're not gonna ask him that question. Grow up, Dusty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Jimmy? Hello. How are you? Good. First time at Fight Life. First time at Fight Life. I'm excited for you. First time on your podcast. I know. Wow. No, you've been on like stuff before. I have. So, question. Since we're at a brewery. I'm so If you... <laughs> yes, because this guy's roughing. That's why he's sober. Okay. So, if you were to have a beer, what would you name it? And what kind of beer would it be? Uh, what would I name it? Be a, well, be an IPA, because those are awesome. Yes, we love IPA around here. I do like IPA. I'm an IPA guy. Something, something with a jumbo, jumbo slam or something. I like that. Jumbo, <laughs> jumbo slam slammer. IPA. There you go. <laughs> That's awesome. Don't, don't take that, Stone Cold. Don't take that. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. Cans would be like this big, though. It'd be that like, big? It'd be like, four, like a 40 ounce. 40, like 40 ounce. Okay. Sounds good. We really smashed. <laughs> <laughs> well, good luck on your little referee Thank debut. You. Yeah. 
Good. Jordan Saint now, right? Yeah, We're the Jordan, Jordan Saint now. You confused me. <laughs> we have a little remix going on here. So how are you? I'm doing okay. I can't complain. Trying to see if you can get onto the Fight Life card. Uh, we're trying, we're trying here. I've been on Fight Life before. Mm -hmm. It didn't go my way, but that's why I'm here again, so I can prove that I want redemption and I'm hungry for it, you know? Yeah, definitely. Here supporting my boy Big Boofa. Hell yeah. Gonna kill it with Sammy G that's top five that are alive. I'm excited. Good match. Yeah. I had Sammy on the pod last week. There's a little, little some trash talking going on here. <laughs> So what do you got coming up? Uh, this weekend I will be in Indianapolis, Indiana for Naptown All Pro Wrestling competing in the Midwest Territory Championship Tournament. My opponent will be a student of AEW star AR Fox. Wow. His name is Superstar Jay Lucas. Sure to be a fun and exciting match. First professional wrestling tournament I've ever had the privilege to be a part of. So I am very excited for that. That's amazing. I'm excited. So more people yes. should check you out if they don't know oh, you. Of course, my Instagram Definitely. is saintspro underscore. Uh, same with my Twitter, saintspro underscore. Follow that. Keep up with the Black Flash. Absolutely. Do whatever you can, baby. Yeah, and you guys see I posted some videos on some like remarkable that he's been at. So keep your, for wrestling. keep your eyes open. You saw him on Blitzkrieg. He wrestled Dante Drago. So that was a good match. That was a really good match. I'm glad people liked it. It was really good. I'm excited that people had the privilege to watch that. Absolutely. Dante so. was actually one of my first coaches when I started out wrestling. Oh, that's so cool. It led to a little, a little more back, backstage lore, you know what I'm saying? Absolutely. Awesome, awesome. So check him out. If you haven't seen him, go check his shit out. You're going to enjoy it. Hell yeah. So we'll see you soon. Big Bufa. What's going on? What's going yo? on? Just a little trash talk on my pod the other day. You what? saw that? The clip with Sammy? We talking, talking trash? trash? He was talking, not me. Sammy was talking trash for your match. Bro, I, I like Sammy. I don't I don't know. I, I mean, I thought he was a cool dude. I mean, now I may need to get a little aggressive, smack him up a little bit. I don't know. <laughs> I'm here for it. I'm, I'm here for it. I gotta be. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the question of the day is: yeah. If a beer was named after you, what would it be called, and what kind of beer would it be? <laughs> See, I, I'm weird. I like like I like the sweet drinks. Okay. Like Mike's Hard Lemonade and stuff like that. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe it would be like a hard. Lemonade or hard seltzer, or something like be, that. It would be something like that. The name. What would I call it? <laughs> this is a hard one. It's a good one. I always get stumped with questions <laughs> like this. <on> this <laughs> All right, hold on. He's thinking about it. It's gonna come. It's gonna be amazing, and then everybody's gonna buy it. It's not gonna be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I promise. <laughs> uh, we're gonna make. We're gonna make some drinks. We're gonna make our own beer. I mean, you're working in a brewery, it's you have to have a beer. The Big Bufa's Sweet Extravaganza. Ooh, the Sweet Extravaganza. I like that. And it will be a hard lemonade. Ooh, okay. Going to stores near you. Yes, yes, we're going to brew it, we're going to see the can, we're going to see, all the, it's going to have like splatter paint all over it, like the can itself. It's going to be amazing. Oh, yeah. So, oh, so let me ask you. So, he's now the remarkable champion. Congratulations. Thank you. And now we have the school that's open, which is awesome. I want to pop by one of the days and come visit. Oh, the so. school is like, it's amazing. It's literally like a dungeon. That's it. Yeah. It reminds me of it's like, it, it's definitely going to help me out a lot. It's just awesome having a spot that's like literally 10 minutes away from my house that I can go to like all the time. That's amazing. So that's awesome. So anybody should like check that out if you're in the New York, Long Island area. Definitely go check it out. They just opened up on the 15th. So check it out. Yes. So and go check out his promo photos. Those photos that you took were pretty awesome. Was like, these, these photos are awesome. So oh, whoever took them, they're cool. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. So well, good luck on your match. You know, thank you so we gotta much. get like you know like at least one hit in because of like the trash talk 
from we, the five. Just one. There will be one. There will be one. <laughs> and maybe a bridge. There'll maybe be. a bridge. Maybe, oh. maybe a bridge. Yo, for some reason lately, <laughs> you've been bringing it out at me. I think Look what I did. I, for some reason, I just know you're watching, and when you're there, the bridge revolution. it just happens. I never plan on doing it until I just think See? about it in the moment. It just, it just happens. So It's almost hard it's to ignore. It's a revolution. I tell you, it's a revolution. So. Have you ever had a match like... Every match was a bridge that you that you saw uh, in a row. No, no, because like the funny thing is, is like years ago nobody did the bridge. Yeah. Are you gonna pop a bridge? Yeah. My bridge is broken. My back the bridge is burnt. The, the bridge, bridge is burnt. burnt now. <laughs> the bridge is burnt. It will not be built back. <laughs> <laughs> But I take full responsibility of all the beautiful bridges that are coming because years ago when I started getting into independence, nobody did the bridge except Anthony Gangone. I mean, me and Gabriel Sky were talking about it too. And, and like nobody was doing it. And like Gabe was one of the ones that was like doing it. And then now like everybody's doing it to pop me. I'm like, yes, it's all my I'm the bridge queen. It, it, it may or may not happen, but I feel like it's gonna. It's like, probably gonna happen. I'm just gonna feel it. So in there. everybody should watch the show if they're not watching please, it. Please, please do. Check it out on Fight TV. Plus. But yeah. Fight Plus. So check, check it out. It out. The big Bufa, Sammy Diaz, top five that are alive. Let's go. Check it out. I found Fight Life's champion. What's going on? Just so waiting here to whoop some ass. <laughs> so the question of the day is. If a beer was named after you, what would it be called and what kind of beer would it be? Oh my god, I don't even know. I don't drink beer like that, so like, I don't know, something that tastes orangey okay. or something along those lines. And uh, what would I call it? That's a great question. I don't know how to name anything, so <laughs> something that makes sense. The drink of it. Ooh, okay. There we go. See, I was like, what's the first thing that's going to come to my head? That. <laughs> it wasn't like something insane. So. No, it's good. It's like fitting. It's totally fitting. So. It's the drink of it. It's the drink of it's your choice. It totally is. So, uh, check out everybody. Your match with uh, Jordan Oliver tonight. If you're not watching Tune it. Tune in on fight. So, check it out. Good luck. <laughs> you fight one more. Jenny Lloyd's here. We got a question. The question of the day is... If a beer was named after you, what would it be called, and what kind of beer? Probably a sour beer, and it would be the different sour. Ooh, the different sour. I like that. I like that. Coming to the store here. <laughs>